I love this show so much. The Boys has been one of my favorite TV shows since 2019 because it's everything I want in a story about superheroes. Before I even heard about The Boys, I thought I was some super genius because I had a story idea similar to this about what it would be like if superheroes were in real life. Yes, I love a lot of the MCU and DC projects, but The Boys is the closest thing to what life would really be like. A lot of superheroes in real life would be assholes. When I first started watching and I saw A-Train completely destroy Huey's girlfriend, my jaw was on the floor because I couldn't believe they would actually start a series like that. And I would say that I've enjoyed everything every season so far. When it comes to Gen V, not a big fan of that. The story and the characters were just okay to me. My favorite characters were Andre, Little Cricket, and Jordan. The main character, Marie, was just okay. Sam was all right, and I hated that character of Kate. And I know it's a part of the boys' cinematic universe now, but whatever. I'm not dying for season two of Gen V the same way. I've been wanting to watch this new season of the boys, and this trailer looks crazy. The trailer doesn't give the same tone that we usually see with this show. Majority of the trailer was very dark and serious, which I loved. Anthony Starr is incredible as Homelander. I don't think he's acting. I think he just shows up to work like that. We go on full on Donald Trump with the parallels to MAGA, which they've been building for a while now. We get a full on fight amongst the citizens with supporters of Starlight and Homelander clashing. This shot of Starlight in comparison to Homelander is exactly what I want to see. I love seeing Homelander crack and him making a little girl jump off the roof is one of my favorite scenes in this show but i have so many questions about this new season like we get a new superhero we get my guy negan joining the cast we get a black noir sighting i love black noir and this ending shot holy shit. homelander just slaughtered somebody R.I.P. to them. But this trailer did exactly what it was supposed to do because I am so excited for this new season. Like I was already looking forward to it, but now my hype is on a whole nother level. I am disappointed that at the end of the trailer it said coming soon. I need a date now. The thing that I personally love is that I have no idea what to expect. I feel left out because I don't read the comics, so I have no idea who Jeffrey Dean Morgan is playing. I have no idea who this new hero is. I have no idea why Black Noir is back. I might have seen a spoiler on Twitter about why Black Noir is back, and if it's true, why do y'all on the internet have to ruin everything. It's kind of the same way I feel about Invincible because I don't read the comics so I have no idea what's going on. I'm just going along with the flow of the show and I love it. Even though Mark gets his ass whipped every single episode. I feel like online for the people that have read the comics they always say the same thing. Just wait bro it gets even crazier. I feel like I heard the same thing about the boys so if the people that have read the comics are still excited about the TV show. I'm excited. I am worried about this cinematic universe they're trying to do. Like I said, I don't really care about Gen V and they just announced another spinoff called The Boys Mexico. I don't read comics so I don't know if Gen V and The Boys Mexico are already their own established things or if they're just some new TV show they're trying to do. I just get so nervous when they do these cinematic universes because there's so many plot points and characters you have to blend together. Like please don't do a multiverse saga. The MCU has already fried my brain enough. But thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe if you're new here. We talk about a bunch of different things on this channel. What are your thoughts on this trailer? Who's your favorite character in the TV show? And is Gen V and the Boys Mexico already their own established things outside of TV? Let me know in the comment section below. Love you guys. Tell someone you love them. Until next time, see you in the next life.